Revere man accused of impersonating a police officer appeared in court today. And while prosecutors argue it was clear what he was doing, the defense says they have it wrong. WBZ's Paula Eben joins us now. And Paula, police say this man was arrested with tools that an officer would have. Yeah, Lisa, but the reason that he had those tools could be at the heart of this case. Police say Sunday night, 43-year-old Brian Boiso was driving around in his white Ford Crown Victoria with flashing yellow lights, and a witness told police he was forcing cars out of the way. When a state trooper pulled him over, police say they found a whole cache of items in the car, including a bulletproof vest, a metal security badge, a large pair of bolt cutters, a folding knife, black handcuffs, a canister of pepper spray, and a breathalyzer test kit. But the defense argues there is an explanation. The suspect works as a security guard. There's various items in Tim imitating a police officer. There's black bulletproof vests, what appeared to be a Glock firearm that was later a BB gun, Your Honor, taser, mace, various badges, items of the like. With a lot of this incident uh, is all fluff. My client did not attempt to stop anybody with these lights. Uh, he didn't identify himself as a police officer. The state police is alleging that he had a lot of possessions that seemed like uh, police items. The suspect was released on bail and ordered to drive only to and from work. Paula Evan, WBC News.